Good morning, everybody. Thank you for coming to my channel. This is Wendy. And today I wanted to show you uh, letters. Letters that turn into envelopes. Or envelopes that turn into letters. However you want to say it. So, um, back in the day, they didn't have envelopes because paper was precious. So, they folded their letters in a way that kind of turned into envelopes and what it looks like is just like this okay here's the back side and here's the front don't mind my handwriting <laughs> i must have been half asleep but you address it on the front uh however you want to you put a stamp however you want and on the back if you have a closure you want to use you can you know this is where they would have put the wax seal and or a sticker which is what I did on one of them but you really don't need to do anything because they lock in place um, you can actually you know have a handwritten letter like this and uh, fold it up to where it closes in and on itself and you may and it makes an envelope what I like to do for my journals is make a packet of a packet of letters and a packet of letters is just one or more sheet of paper tied or bound together um, I actually had a third one in here that was a different size but I took it out because I wanted to show you guys uh, the different sizes so this is what I like to do I like to stick these in my journals uh, just plain paper and it gives them more writing spots or yourself more writing spots other than just, you know, journal tags. So let me show you real quick how I do it. Uh, there's two ways you can fold it because if you notice, this is a different, a little bit different shape than the rest of them. Okay. So let me make some space. So you just need a... Oh, let me, my paper's torn. Let's get a sheet of paper. All right, so the first way is putting it landscape. Not this way, but landscape. And you're going to fold it in half. Okay. And then open it back up. And then fold this end. Oops into the center like this and this side into the center like this okay now you're going to fold the top down about an inch and a half two inches okay just like this and this bottom one you want to bring all the way up let me show you here all the way up and but you want to leave you can you can go down further you just don't want to bring it all the way to the edge of this part okay so I bring I brought it up this far so what you do is you tuck it into the flap you just made and that makes your envelope so you write on it who it's to stamp it whatever and on the back this is the closure this is how you open it but it stays closed so you make a bunch of these and wrap a ribbon around them and then you have a packet of letters now uh, the other way to fold this uh just slightly different is keep it keep your paper portrait ways and you're going to fold it lengthways just like this okay then you're going to fold the side into the center and this side into the center all right then you're going to bring this up in half okay open it back up then bring the bottom up to the center again fold okay and then fold it again just like this now the top you want to bring down not all the way just like here okay I didn't bring it all the way down 
and then you tuck this folded piece into the flap. Whoopsie. Let's see if we can get them in there. Okay. So here is the square. This one is a little bit more same size piece of paper. Oops. All right, same size piece of paper, but gives you two different size envelopes. So I just, I'll put them in a packet with a ribbon and just insert into your journal. These are called Regency Letters. So let me know what you think. If you do them, share them. Uh, thank you for coming. You guys have a good day. Thank you. Bye.